In church, we often use a lot of lingo and, and terms that are kind of foreign to modern culture. Sometimes it's good to use those terms because it, it maybe gives us an appreciation for God and His work, a, a holiness uh, to what we're learning about. There's certain terms, though, that are difficult to understand. I think of one of those terms is one that we often say in connection with our prayers, for Jesus' sake. What does that mean? Does that mean that we're saying our prayers on behalf of Jesus to help Him benefit Him out? No, it actually doesn't mean that at all. And that phrase is used in our prayers for Jesus' sake. What we're really saying and really asking is that God would hear our prayers on account of what Jesus has done for us. Jesus says in John 14, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. The only reason that we are able to come before God with our prayers is through Christ and what he has done for us. And so we acknowledge this. We say, for Jesus' sake. Not because we're praying for Jesus, but because we want God to know that we have the right to come before him because of what Christ has done through his death and suffering for us on the cross. So next time you hear that phrase, for Jesus' sake, think about what it means. That we are praying knowing that Christ has made us acceptable before God. Amen.